Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying these seasonal bark fins. These are uh, bark fins snacking chocolates. They were $3.99 at Lucky's Market. Uh, I have the dark chocolate peppermint pretzel with sea salt. Uh, ooh, that sounds good. Mm -hmm. um, I have dark chocolate gingerbread. Okay. So we're going to do the gingerbread first. Yes. But you have to read about it. Okay. They are a, <laughs> a fair trade, non GMO. Um, da, 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 da. Their one serving is, um, well, you jerked it right. Sorry, I'm sorry. 220 calories. And it is uh, 40 grams. And these are made in New York, New York. Start spreading the news. What's the next line? I'm leaving to <laughs> death. <laughs> okay. Just smells, it smells like, like chocolate. dark chocolate. Yeah, chocolate. It smells like dark chocolate. Yeah, mm -hmm. and it, they're cool it's, looking. it's dark. They look like they've got little, um, here, well, you can go ahead. Uh, it looks like they've taken gingerbread cookie and crumbled it up and then mm -hmm. covered it in chocolate. That's what it looks like. Gingerbread didn't me yet, but it usually does. I think that's good. The dark chocolate, it's a little bitter. Yeah. You do get the ginger, bitter. but it's not its not overly strong, I don't think. No, it doesn't have a super bad bite. Right. Um, it doesn't burn like some gingers do. Those are just okay. Uh, I'm not a big fan of that dark chocolate. It's a little bitter dark chocolate. It's not something I could eat all the time because it is such dark chocolate, but I know a lot of you all like dark chocolate and you appreciate it. Yeah. So I think you would really you might appreciate like these. But then it's got that weird um, gingery kind of spice flavor in the back. It's kind of an odd, it's an odd combination for me. See, I think it's, I do think it's good. I do think it works. Um, and maybe it's the dark chocolate that cuts down on the ginger being be. so strong. Uh, but no. it's just not something I would have all the time no. because of the dark chocolate. Okay, now these are the dark chocolate peppermint pretzel with sea salt. That sounds um, one uh, 1.4 ounce, 40 grams is 210 calories. So those are 10 more than this, the same thing. I mean, this is 10 more. The dark chocolate is 10 more than that. Oh, okay. Mine were 220. Did I... Did I not open that right? I don't think I did. No, you, well, it tore at an, uh, <laughs> yeah. an angle. Sometimes I get it and sometimes I don't. But I do like- I don't like, think that's your fault. I think it's a design fault. I do like that they're in a resealable bag. Yeah, that's nice. Anytime they put resealable. Okay. Did if you, you still were, like them? No, I did, but I'm just thinking about it. If you're in a hurry or- <laughs> If you're That's in the, the car from, or something. The from snacking, uh, a lot. This doesn't smell as dark, but that could be just. It is dark though, right? Yeah, it's dark. It is small, right? I want to make sure I get some of that peppermint. Feels like pretzels. The pretzels in them? Yeah, there's pretzels. Oh, pretzels. That's where the sea salt comes from. It's on the pretzels. But I got such a tiny, tiny amount of peppermint. I got mainly pretzel, pretzel and I sea did. salt. It was all pretzel chocolate. Pretzel and sea salt. And chocolate. Mm -hmm, and chocolate. I didn't taste. I didn't taste peppermint at all. Very, there's, very, very light. There's teeny tiny little pieces in there. Mm-hmm. But um, well, it shouldn't taste. When so I said you may get a piece and you may not. When it says peppermint, though, it should be mixed in with the chocolate, though. I just love it. I love the dark chocolate. It's not as uh, biting. It doesn't seem maybe it's because dark. of the um, the pretzel mm -hmm. and the peppermint that it doesn't seem as dark as what was in here. No, I'm sure it's, it's the same chocolate, but it just doesn't come across that way at all. My problem is though they already sell a pretzel. Right. So all they did with this was to add the peppermint, and Which it really didn't taste. have a lot of peppermint in it. Yeah, I mean, I literally, I thought I tasted it first, and it's like, you know what? I don't. I just, that was my imagination. I do not taste peppermint. I mean, not even in slight mm -hmm. bit. I think that if they're gonna do it next year. I do think they need to put more peppermint in they it. They need to put you, peppermint the same size as the pretzels. You really don't know that it's there. Mm -hmm. No, so, you would never guess that. So. I do like them. Mm, they're good. But not for peppermint. Not for peppermint. So, I'm going to have a picture of the M. If you all have tried these and if you've gotten big hunks of peppermint, if you if you uh, 
say, hey, you must have gotten a dead bag, leave me a comment below and let me know because I want to hear about it. That happens sometimes. Yeah, it does happen sometimes. I'm going to have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.